all right welcome back to the channel today we're going to be watching lord of the rings and the return of the king extended edition now we're already on the third movie which is pretty surprising honestly because each movie was like three hours and 30 minutes so far and so oh wait no this one's four hours and 23 minutes holy shit holy shit well okay when do the credits start because th there's a good like 25 minutes of credits in every movie okay they start out at four hours and one minute so we got four hours oh my god okay well i'm excited because the last movie the two towers it had a very good cliffhanger it had a very good cliffhanger in it right now okay so Gollum, he's gonna betray frodo and sam he's gonna betray them because apparent because master frodo betrayed Gollum, and now Gollum's like really hurt and everything so so that's Gollum's intentions now right he said i'll let her do it, or he said we could let her do it i don't know who this her is supposed to be i don't know who he's talking about i'm sure we'll find out but then as far as like aragorn and gandalf and all of them they defeated the orcs they defended helm's deep from the orcs so that was pretty nice and then pip and mary they got the ents to isengard and they destroyed Sorman's work they destroyed everything he was working on so i don't know what he's gonna do to like bounce back from this all shit's destroyed so anyways i'm gonna stop wasting time we're just gonna hop right into this movie if you'd like to watch the full length reaction that'll be available on patreon as well early there's no early access because this is the last movie so let's get started oh smeagol oh, smeagol. oh we're about to learn his backstory okay okay Boy, you gotta let go of that. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. This is how Schmeagel found the ring. Brother found it underwater. Guessing it's his brother. They have like really similar names. Yeah, and that's Schmeagel, because that's Andy Circus. Hmm. Don't tell me he kills his brother over the ring. That'd be, that'd be so sad. Oh! Oh, he's killed him. He's killed him. Damn. Oh, no. Damn. So, yeah, as soon as he saw the ring, he just took him over immediately. Didn't even hold it and then just controlled it, you know? Seduced him before he even hold it, held it. Precious. Okay, he talks the same too before he like turned into a golem. Totally just physically transformed him. Just took over his entire life. That should be enough. For what? The journey home. Come on, Frodo probably hasn't even thought about the journey home because, you know, it's like he's probably, he's probably gonna have to die in the process to destroy the ring. And he's probably accepted that. So if it'll cost him his life to destroy the ring, I think he'll, I think he'll do it. The return of the king. Yep, flooded. So where's Sorman? Is he still in the tower up there, or is he dead? But there is a wizard to manage here. Look to his tower. Okay, he's still here then. Even in defeat, Saruman is dangerous. We need him alive. We need him to talk. Can we not take counsel together as we once did, my old friend? Nah. When you answer for the burning of the Westfold and the children that lie dead there, when you hang from a gibbet, mm. thousands more are now at risk. But you could save them, Saruman, deep in the enemy's council. So you have come here for information? Mm hmm. Obviously, that's why you're alive. Something festers in the heart of Middle Earth. Something that you have failed to see. Even now. He presses his advantage. His attack will come soon. Okay. You are all going to die. 
So are you. You cannot think that this ranger will ever sit upon the throne of Gondor. Crept from the shadows will never be crowned king. Yes, he will. Tell me, what words of comfort did you give the halfling before you sent him to his doom? Come down, Saruman, and your life will be spared. Mm, I believe Gandalf. I have no use for it! <laughs> Bro, he's fine, he's fine, he's fine. Yeah, I see that. Your staff is broken. Damn, dude, yeah, that was so powerful now. You need not follow him. I hope we kill Grima. You were once a man of Rohan. And of Rohan. Watch him push him off. The victory at Helm's Deep does not belong to you. Come down. Be free of him. Free? He will never be free. Yeah, he's gonna kill him. He's gonna kill Grima. Tell us what you know. Oh, oh, Grima. Grima. Yeah, he's dead. Someone's gonna kill him. Hell, prisoner here. Oh, no fucking way. What? Ah! Oh, shit. And, and Grima? Wait, so they both die? What? Ah! Wow, okay. Oh, Okay, yeah, he's for sure dead. Send word to all our allies. And to okay, I thought like Sorman was gonna just like turn around and just like disarm him and then kill him, you know, but like, nah. <laughs> hey, we should get, we should collect that. We should grab that. We can definitely see what he was talking about with that. Pippin! Oh, Pippin's gonna grab it. Yes. I'll take that, my lad. Quickly now. It was not Théoden of Rohan who led our people to victory. It was him. I feel something. <laughs> she was drunk. A slight tingle in my fingers. Okay, I don't think you're drunk. I think you're drugged. I think you're roofied. Pippin! Yeah, why is Pippin looking at Gandalf like that? When he handed Gandalf the thing... You give him a weird look and right there too. Pippin affected by it when he picked it up? Every day Frodo moves closer to Mordor. Do we know that? That Frodo is alive? Yes, he's alive. I'm both startled from this. Talking in his sleep. Children both. Okay. okay, I thought one of them were gonna wake up and hear him talking in his sleep. Smeagol wants to see him. Dead. He did it once. Mm -hmm. He can do it again. His brother, yep. It's us. We must get it back. Patience, my love. <laughs> we must lead them to a star. Okay. Us, the stars. And the... Up the stairs we go. You tunnel. There's no coming out. She's always on. She always needs to feed. He gets his filthy oxes. Okay, is it like a, okay, it's like a pet or something? Like a dragon? <laughs> oh, oh. Sam's, Sam's gonna hear And take it for me! Okay, he's talking hella loud, too. Well, him. Well, him. The hobbit says, hard. Oh, oh, oh. oh shit! Alone. I heard it from his own mouth. He makes the murder us. Smeagol wouldn't have to fly. Call me a liar. You're a liar. You scared me. We're lost. I don't care. Yeah, we still need him for directions, but he's leading us into a trap. He's a villain. By ourselves, Sam. Not without a guide. Come, Smeagol. <laughs> Ooh, look at that dirty ass look he gave Sam. I mean, I get Sam's POV of just Smeagol, of like hating Gollum and everything, because you know he's he's an all-op really. Like, and Sam literally just heard him say he's gonna kill them <laughs> and stuff. And like Sam's super protective over Frodo, so I get it. But then I also get Frodo's perspective where he's like, no, we need the guide, even though there's no he's walking us into a trap. 
but it's like still we need somewhat of a guide to because like if he were to leave right now i would not know which way to go to get anywhere so it's like okay And I feel like he's just gonna break her damn hard. Like she's gonna like, like he knows she likes him. He has to know, dude. He has to know. And I feel like he's just kind of friend zoning her. Like he's he's there for her, but he's like nothing more, nothing more, just friends, platonic. Because you know he has that thing with Arwen, but he thinks Arwen already left. He knows Arwen already left, I guess. But I feel like he's just kind of it's like I'm not ready for that yet. But it didn't really confirm if Arwen actually left or not. Like it. Like she was conflicted when she was talking to her dad. So if she didn't leave and he sees Arwen, he's leaving her. He's like, see ya to that girl. <laughs> That's going to crush her, dude. <laughs> Wait, oh, he's just sleeping. <laughs> yeah, what are you doing? You're try Why are you trying to take it from him? Bro, how would your eyes not? Dude, your eyes would get so dry. If you're sleeping with your eyes open. Oh, you mad. I just want to look at it. Ooh. He is here. Mm -hmm. I see you. He's brought sore on here. Oh, he can't let go. Help! Stand up! Did you tell him about Frodo and the ring? A fool, but an honest fool, he remains. All right, all right. Old Sauron, nothing of Frodo and the ring. Okay, okay, thank God. Sauron moves to strike the city of Minas Tirith. He knows the heir of Elendil has come for men are not as weak as he supposed. He will raise Minas Tirith to the ground before he sees a king return to the... Rohan must be ready for war. Why should we ride to the aid of those who did not come to ours? Because it's the right thing to do. What do we owe Gondor? Because if they lose, then it's one last ally for us to fight them. So it directly affects us if we don't help them. So we're going alone. Always have to look. I don't know. I can't help it. You never. I'm sorry. All right. I won't do it again. You probably will. Understand. Maybe not. You know that, but you'll do something like that. He's going to be looking for you, Pip. You're coming with me, Mary. Come on. Yeah, Mary is so mad at Pip's negligence. And you better hope we don't have one of those on our tail. Something for the road. Damn, he's not going. But we'll see each other soon. <sighs> we'll... Uh, I don't know if we will. I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen. Oh. Mary! <laughs> That's sad. Best friend split apart. He's always followed me since before we were tweens, but I was always there to get him out. And now you can't be there for him now. Okay, here we got Arwen. Mm. She's imagining her son. She's imagining him with their child. How happy they could be. Dude, I'm, I'm calling her. She's not going. She's not going. She wants to live that life with Aragorn. There's nothing for you here. Yes, there is. There is something for me. Damn. It's so sad. We cannot delay. Oh! She's going back. She's going back. Damn, that's a great shot. Tell me what you have seen. You have the gift of foresight. I looked into your future and I saw death. There is also life. You saw there was a child. You saw my son. If I leave him now, I will regret it forever. Mm-hmm. It is time. Good for you. Huge shall be blade that was broken. The crownless again shall be king. Mm-hmm. We're gonna make our Aragorn king. We're making him king in this movie. The life of the Eldar is leaving you. Already? This was my choice. There is no ship now that can bear me yet. Mm-hmm. 
Sucks for the dad though, because he, he knows she's gonna die. Right? Just passed into the realm of Gondor. Yep, that's the tree. Just. In fact, it's better if you don't speak at all. About it. Yeah, just shut the fuck up. Okay, don't don't say a word. And with counsel. How does he know? To explain this. Ooh. You come to tell me why my son is dead. He died honorably. At least, you know. Boromir died to save us. He failed defending us from many foes. Mm hmm Oh, okay, Pippin. This is my first command to you. Bring me the How ring. How did you escape oh. and my son did not? So mighty a man as he was. Because he died protecting us. One arrow. And Boromir was pierced by many. Mm-hmm. War is coming. As steward, you are charged with the defense of this city. Where are Gondor's armies? Light the beacons. You think you are wise, Mithrandir? All right, cool. We tried to help you. Do you think the eyes of the White Tower are blind? Healed against Mordor, and with your right, you'd seek to supplant me. Who, who rides with their dinner fro hand? There we go. Word has reached my ears of this Aragorn, son of mm -hmm. Arathorn, and I. Authority is not given to you to deny the mm -hmm. return of the king, Stuart. Oh. All of Gondor is mine, and no others. All right, my boy got a little bit of an ego. Now, the whim of a madman it will fall. Tough. Will fall because of one man's ego. The rule of Gondor was given over to lesser men. Oh, shit, damn. It's right there. Mordor. Yes, there it lies. Very close to Gondor. This is not the weather of the world. When the shadow of Mordor reaches this city, it's wraps. It will begin. Very impressive. So where are we off to next? Oh, it's too late. <laughs> oh, There's God. no leaving this city. Oh. Oh. Help must come to us. Oh, okay. Well, that's lint. So we, we're banking on Frodo doing this. Just a feeling. I don't think I'll be coming back. Yep. You will. Of course you will. We're going there and back again. Honestly, I think Frodo dies. I think he dies doing it. Come on, Hobbits! Mustn't stop now, this well! So I imagine this is just a ceremonial position. <laughs> oh no, we'll be using that. We'll be using everything right here. Frodo and Sam. There never was much hope. Just <laughs> a fool's hope. Damn. Our enemy is ready. Full strength gathered. Not only orcs, but men as well. That's right. If the garrison at Osgiliath falls, the last defense of this city. Sauron has yet to reveal his deadliest servant. The one, the one they say no living man can kill. Which king of Agmar? You've met him before. Hmm. He stabbed Frodo on weather top. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, this guy, okay. He is the lord of the Nazgul. Minas Morgul is his lair. Wait, I feel like that's where Gollum's taking them. Into murder. Hmm. A secret stab. Damn, that is steep as hell. Oh no. oh no, he's uh he can't control it. They're calling me. Okay, whoa, whoa. Oh yeah, damn, they can see it. Wait, is that just alert uh the Nazul? Did that just trigger Sauron to send his army? Ooh, a dragon. Yeah, wait, is that the guy? Yeah, it is. Okay, okay, okay. We're in his lair. The Witch King. He's probably like, who the fuck? I can feel his blade. Mm hmm. He's already pierced you once. We come to it at last. 
All right, did trigger it. All right, we're going. Okay, I feel like what makes this guy unkillable by men is he could probably see. He probably has 20-20 vision. The other ones can't see for shit. It's like they're already really raw. They're already raw fighting and everything. Like they're literally assassins, but they, they just can't see, or they could just barely see, you know. But I feel like the main guy, the Witch King, he he has perfect vision. So the so that's the difference. <laughs> Up, up, up the stairs we go, and then it's into the tunnel. Hey, 